You know what that is? What? It's rude. You're Rudy Huxtable. <laughs> I'm not trying to be rude, but babe. I... What? Go ahead. We're having a lapse of communication. Okay. What's going on is we in traffic. You cutting people off because you don't know how to use your blinkers. Ah. And now the flow of traffic is all messed up because you got me smashing on my oh, brakes. Oh, that's what I'm doing? Yeah. Okay. How about this? Use your blinkers. Mm -hmm. Blinkers can be a pad and a pen. If you feel like you need to say something while I'm talking, you can just write it down. If you have any rebuttals. What? And when I'm done, then you can recite. So, okay, just to make sure I'm clear. Mm -hmm. To make sure I don't cut you off. Okay. You want me to have a pen and a paper. Mm -hmm. You want me to bring that out mm -hmm. during our conversation so that whenever I have a thought or a rebuttal that I want to give, so I don't cut you off, I write that joint down. <laughs> and then I wait until you finish. And then I share what's in my notes. Yes. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. Okay, you know what? You want me to bring out a pen and a pad? You know what? I'm going to try my damnedest to make sure I have one on deck every day. Because I care and I love you that much. Oh my God. See, and that, that warms my heart. <laughs> it really does. So can we get back to our conversation? Please. Thank you. I used to have to wash dishes in the snow. This ain't washing dishes. <laughs> Spot free rinsing dishes. That's what this is. All you're doing is loading and pushing buttons. So wait, so what do we have a dishwasher for if we're not gonna use it? To show niggas that we balling. That's the only I reason why you have a dishwasher. I can't. No other reason. Uh, babe, did you uh dry my black clothes? Hold on one second. Wow. Proceed. What's that? What's, what's, what's going on? This is my pencil and pad that you told me that you want me to have so I don't cut you off. I told you to get a pen back. Remember when you said, use your blinkers? Blinkers. Uh-huh. Right. You yeah. remember that? Okay. And you said, you should have a pencil and pad and jot uh -huh. down your thoughts so that you don't cut me off. So this is me trying your method. You know, I thought about it and I was like, you know, that's not a bad idea because I don't want to cut him off. I don't intentionally do that. And so maybe it is a good idea for me to like jot down my thoughts like I'm in a seminar or something. So I told you to go get a time from enslaved book? <laughs> you told me to get a pad and this is what I had available. So that's let me talk about my notepad, okay? okay? Um, but you do look like you walked to school on dirt road. <laughs> Listen, I want to make you happy, okay? And you said this is what you wanted me to do. So you turn our relationship into a TED talk. No, babe, you turn this into a TED talk. Oh, I did. It's my duty as your woman, because I love you, to hold you accountable because we make each other better. And so this is me holding you accountable so that I can help us be better and be more communicative. Did that word come with the book? Um, you're not gonna cut me off. No, that's what my notes are here for. So I'm just gonna talk. You write clothes, so you remember your thoughts. Clothes, yeah. Mm -hmm. my, Cause um, you cut yourself off that time. All right. Um, you asked me, did I wash your clothes? Yes. Um, so See, I was listening to you. All right, well, uh, you know what? I'm gonna think about this. Okay. I'm gonna think about this. All right. Okay.